Hi guys, welcome to SA Technical. In this video, I am going to show you how to fix Windows 11 update not showing in Windows update settings. And also this video will help to fix we could not install this update error code 0x800f0922 or something did not go as planned, no need to worry undoing changes. Windows 11 is the latest upgrade of Windows operating system. And these issues can occur on both supported or unsupported computer during update to the latest version of Windows 11. So, if you interrupt with this problem during upgrade, then this tutorial will definitely help to fix this problem and also this video will help to create a single USB installer that will cover both supported and unsupported hardware. So, let's get started. At first, let me show you from Windows Update Settings. As you can see, after clicking on check for update button, it does not show any option to upgrade to the latest version of Windows 11. And as you can see, this is the old version 21H2 of Windows 11. So if you want to install latest Windows 11 version 22H2 that comes with new design and features, then go to Windows search and search for Windows 11 download and press enter. Now click on this official link then it will open Windows 11 download official website. Now scroll down and go to download Windows 11 disk image section. Click on this drop down menu to select Windows 11 multi edition ISO file and click download button. Select the product language and click confirm. Now click on 64 bit download button to download the latest version of Windows 11 ISO. Save your Windows 11 ISO file where you want to save. After downloading, double click on Windows 11 ISO file to mount with Windows Explorer. Now simply double click on setup.executable file to launch the installer. If your computer is supported then fine. If not supported then close the installer and go to Windows search. and search for Rufus and press enter. Now click on this first link, then it will open Rufus official website. Now scroll down and download Rufus 3.21. This latest version of Rufus supported the bypassing of Windows 11 system requirement like CPU, TPM, Secure Boot, Storage and RAM. After downloading, you will need an empty USB pen drive. At least 8GB of capacities. Now insert your USB pen drive to your computer's USB port and launch the Rufus. Now select your USB pen drive, click on select button and select Windows 11 ISO file using file browser. Select image option standard Windows installation. Now here's the most important step select partition scheme MBR. Now press ALT plus E key combination to enable target system type, legacy or UEFI. It will help to create a single USB installer that will cover both supported and unsupported hardware. Now you may change the volume level but you should leave most of the option as they are. Now click on start button. Now check these two boxes if you want to remove requirement for TPM 2.0, 4GB RAM secure boot and Microsoft's online account. Once done, click on OK to create a bootable Windows 11 media. Read the warning message about your USB drive and click OK to continue. 
Now keep patience until the installation process is completed. Well, now our Windows 11 bootable USB drive is completely ready to use. Now close the Rufus. After that, go to File Explorer and open your created Windows 11 bootable USB drive. Now launch the Windows 11 setup.exe. Select recommended option and click next. Well, as you can see, no more interruption or error message are being displayed about Windows 11 system requirements. If you encounter with any interruption or error message, then disconnect the internet connection. Now accept the license terms and click next. Now here's the most important steps. Click on change what to keep. Now select the first option to keep your personal files and applications. Don't select second and third option otherwise your data will be gone. And click on next. Now click on install and keep patience until the installation process is finishes. I just fast forward this boring part. Now keep patience, your PC will be reboot. Please keep patience until setup is finishes the update process. Well, as you can see, the upgrade procedure was successful. Now go to Windows search and search for Windows update settings. Now click on check for update button to install latest quality features and security update for Windows 11 version 22H2.
Now let me show you the Windows 11 version status. Well, as you can see, the Windows 11 Pro Edition version 22H2. Once the upgrade procedure is completed, just run the Windows update for necessary device driver and software. So, I hope this guide was helpful for you. If you have any question, then please let us know. Please like, comment and share. We need your support. And guys, please don't forget to subscribe our channel. Thank you. Thanks for watching. Have a nice day.